a town of 1,200 people. Welcome to Jeff Davis County in Fort Davis, Texas. So how many we registered to vote? This is a huge, huge turnout for this little town. We're proud that you're here. This is a standing room crowd only. Here comes Beto, our next senator. Our next senator of the United States, Beto O'Rourke. My pleasure to introduce you. Thank you. Hey, how's everybody doing? Good to see you all. Good to be out with you. Good evening. With fewer now than 100 days left before we decide the future, the fate, and the fortune, not just of Texas, but of this country together. No pressure, Fort Davis, it's, but it's on us right now to make sure that we stand up and that we are more than a match for the things that concern us. The, uh, lack of decency and dignity and civility in public life right now um, that we need to restore. And all of us can be about that. I feel like people are tired of what's coming out of Washington right now and ready for something different, a different message than what we've been getting. I'm ready for, for a change in this country. And it seems like he is a, he's a leader in that. In the last three months, by taking PAC money, by uh, drawing from a national fundraising base after he ran for the presidency, Ted Cruz was able to raise more than $4 million in just one three-month period. But in that same period of time, without a dime from PACs, with an average contribution of $33, every single one of those contributions coming from a real, live human being, we, to his $4 million, raised $10.4 million in that same period of time. So this is the answer to the challenge that we have. we got to win this and win this the right way. I think he really is doing a great job of reaching across the aisle to, to connect with uh, people that would ordinarily never even think about uh, voting you know, for a Democrat. But uh, Beto's not your normal Democrat. He's a real Texan. I think Texas, with this proud tradition of gun ownership and gun safety, can actually take the lead on these issues and make sure that everyone can lead their lives to their full potential. I think he, he represents America first, Texas, and all the best things about Texas that people think about Texas, uh, being straight up, being open and honest, and uh, caring about everybody. I support Beto because he supports, I think, the way America ought to be. We're a humane society. We're not what we are today. We always have been. I'm, I'm conservative, but I'm not so conservative that I don't have room for everybody else. No, never, never forget you. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, great. How are you? Congratulations for coming out. Get out. Yeah. Excuse me, the tiny.